and when you're from the outside and you come to a city like Toronto and you get a chance to see everything and you get to really marvel at everything that's available here, it's it's truly incredible. And I've had Tontonians say to me, I can't believe how you talk about Toronto. I'm like, go elsewhere in Canada. Go elsewhere really around the GTA and you will never get to experience what you get to experience in this particular pocket. So. Um, the Queen West Art Crawl obviously has my very biased support, um, so thank you for allowing us to be a part of it. And of course, we want everybody to sell lots of art and get lots of attention, and we're here to help um, however we can. So um, now you all know that this began as a one-day event. It's now a three-day festival that in incorporates arts of all types, and um, it's now an incorporated not-for-profit not arts organization. And now it has this clear vision, it has a very clear direction, um, and of course, uh, it'll only get bigger and better from here on. Now, you also know, as I know, because I actually walked all the way from 299 Queen West, I decided to make the walk because since I moved all the way up east, it's been a long time since I've done this walk. Took me an hour, but I'm really glad that I did it because once again, it allowed me to familiarize myself with what I love about this area so much and why we. I end up moving back here at some point soon. Um, but you also know that this area is home to musicians, um, artists, to uh, writers, and to people who express themselves to very many different art forms who are always happy to collaborate. And this is an opportunity uh, for people to do that as well. You also know that the events, especially the one tomorrow, I know I'm going to bring my little guy to it, is the uh, event in Trinity Goldwoods Park. It goes from 11 to 6, I believe. Uh, what's it called officially? Outdoor art show and sale. God. Presented Perfect. by Streetcar. Okay, presented by Streetcar. Outdoor art show and sale. And of course, uh, lots of events for kids too. They love to paint it. The weather's going to be amazing. So I know I'm excited to come. Um, and this is incredible. Over a hundred thousand people are expected to come out here over the next three days. So that's amazing. Woo! Sponsors, and they are Streetcar, who's our outdoor art show and sales sponsor. <laughs> uh, above Ground Art Supplies, which is our art supply sponsor. West Queen West BIA, our best new show prize sponsor. And Second City, our kids zone sponsor. We also have Move Audio, Toronto Community News, The Grid. Blog TO, Ontario, uh, sorry, Ontario Trillium Foundation, Ontario Ministry of Tourism, City of Toronto, and Earthsea. Give an applause. <laughs> okay, we'd also like to thank our programming partners who include Daniel Frey, Benny Ann Jordan, Rick Walter Nolan, Mia Nielsen, David Liss, and Venus Lukic. We also have our opening night partners and other community partners to thank. We include Art Battle, that's going to be the street that is going to be fun. Uh, CP24, thank you. Uh, the Gladstone Hotel, uh, Workman Arts and Camping. Street Streetcar Developments, we're an urban mid rise real estate developer specializing in boutique condominium lofts on Toronto's main avenues. Our projects span the downtown core from the east end in the beach all the way to right here in Queen West. If you look out this window here, you'll see one of our current projects under construction at 2 Gladstone. And we've recently launched a sister project at 8 Gladstone. So one of our philosophies at Streetcar is to seamlessly integrate ourselves into each unique community in which we build and develop. So with Queen West, that has been an easy integration. We've recently built a presentation center and office and in doing so, we called upon local artists to collaborate with us on a number of works and pieces for the space to truly bring to life the authenticity and creativity of this area. So we are truly happy to be a part of this event. Also sponsoring as well as participating, we will have an art exhibit set up for the duration of the weekend, as well as we've set up in Trinity Bellows Park if you'd like to stop by and say hello. So thanks for having us and enjoy the festival. So 
I just want to once again thank uh, our staff at Parkdale Community Development Group for making my life so much easier uh, over the past few months. Uh, Pia, Mac, Jada, Sam, Margaret, um, you've all been just rock solid and you know you think of everything when I haven't thought of everything. You uh, have just the most wonderful cheery faces when you come in every morning and you go the distance and for that I'm truly, truly grateful. Um, and of course, you know, overseeing us all is Cindy Goldrick, our executive director. She makes sure that I eliminate my passive uh, voice in my press releases and my Oxford commas, and she keeps us on task and um, inspires us every day, and we're just really grateful to have you. It's just been really special having you with us. Um, she's been with us since um, November of last year, and she has made the most colossal difference to the organization. So thanks, Cindy.